Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Andrea. Thank you for stopping by. Today's video is the first of a fashion haul from me. This is a, I've got a huge H&M box to unbox with you, which includes loungewear, outerwear, some denim, a little bit of homeware. I've been spending, admittedly, most of my money on beauty and skincare. I've done quite a few hauls on here. But today, I'm unboxing mainly clothes because my wardrobe is just, I don't know, it just needs a real refresh. So I'm gonna go through what I've got. This is all kind of new in stuff, I think it's new in. But anyway, I've got it in the Black Friday sale. So I've got 20% off for uh, a member. But yeah, I've got a huge box. So I'm gonna unbox this with you. I feel out of breath just holding it. Let's put it on the floor. I can't really remember what I got. <laughs> Okay, what I'll do is I will show you kind of first first impressions and then I'll do like a cutaway so you can have a look what it's like on. I have had a big lunch though, but like I say, most of it's loungewear, so I need to be having some big lunches with this stuff. First thing first, I've got myself some tracksuit bottoms. So these are high waist, regular fit, black, cuffed, tracksuit bottoms. Black doesn't really come up very well on here, does it? But these were £14.99. So I'm not sure how I feel about this, but I was desperate for some tracksuit bottoms because quite frankly, I live in Sean's. They feel a little bit thin, I'm not gonna lie, compared to the men's ones. But hopefully, I've got these in a medium. I usually take like a size 10, I'd say in trousers. So yeah, there's some tracksuit bottoms there. I get a hoodie. Yeah, I've got a hoodie, which I don't think is part of the matching set, but this was $17.99 with drawstring here. It's just a simple black oversized, black oversized hoodie that I can just wear with either these or I think I've got another pair of tracksuit bottoms. I did. So, the other pair of tracksuit bottoms that I got, these ones, so these are, okay, I thought these were white, but actually they're a really, really nice cream. So can you see here, they probably look quite white, but my jumper's like quite cream, it's like an off-white. So, yeah, these are lovely. These seem a little bit better than the black ones. I don't think the black ones have a pocket. Oh no, they do have a pocket. Okay, both have pockets. So yeah, these are two different styles. They're $14.99. Again, just some tracksuit bottoms with a cuff leg. I go on so many dog walks and I do work from home during the day. So I think these will be a good one, I hope. These are the tracksuit bottoms. They, like I say, I've got a size medium. If you want them a little bit baggier, I'm a size 10, maybe I could have gone to a large, but I think a large would be quite big on the waist. But yeah, this is the hoodie, this is the medium, and the cuffs, the bottom, the bottom are nice enough. Quite pleased with that. Okay, these are the white joggers. So, like I say, these are really, really nice fit. Here, nice tie, tie waist here, so I can tie them up. The bum fits quite nicely. I mean, white tracksuit bum isn't the most flattering anyway. But the leg cuffs, a nice, really nice actually. The black leg cuffs, they're all the same. They've got like a three, three tier cuff, which I really like. But yeah, are they see through? I don't, I don't think they're that see through, which is really great. The next thing that I got, which I'm actually really, really excited about, is a fleece. So, let me get into this. I think these are called a shirling fleece. So it's this gorgeous, like, no, more like a teddy fleece, actually. 
really obsessed with Teddy at the moment. Like this chair is a Teddy chair. We've got a Teddy throw downstairs. So this I got in a size medium and it's got lovely kind of pocket here and a really nice drawstring down here so you can kind of put it to size. So it looks ever so slightly cropped. Oh, I'm really excited about that. Yeah, really lovely. And then little cuffed sleeves here. It is so soft. Honestly, so soft. Oh, I can't wait to try this on. I hope it fits. But I thought this would look really nice with just the black tracksuit bottoms or even the white tracksuit bottoms. So I'll try these on with the two. We have here the teddy fleece and I honestly feel all the warmth. I love this. I feel all the warmth. Like I say, it's got a, where is it? Tie here. So this is actually like, um, what's that called? A bow? <laughs> um, you've got your sleeves here. I've teamed this with my white tracksuit bottoms, which I actually think looks really cute. I'm really kind of pleased with that. I got it in a size medium. I definitely actually prefer this over the black hoodie. I think I need a black hoodie, but they do this in black, so I think I might return the black hoodie and get this because you can't deny that this is Comfy Cozy Vibes 101. This kept going in and out of stock. I am so pleased that it stayed in for me for when I bought it. So this is a puffer jacket and I was so excited about this. I was really toying with black because black is of course, like especially if you've got a dog, a bit more functional. However, I really wanted this colour. So this is like an um, ecru, mm, is it? It's just like a beigey white, it's off white and I figured it would go with either a black hoodie underneath, these are actually trousers, but <laughs> black hoodie underneath, or even a white hoodie underneath. So I'll try that on with the tracksuit bits because I figured that's probably the most likely gonna be able to wear it. But so it's got a silver zip here, which actually feels really sturdy. This I got in a size, again, medium. So I wanted it really oversized. And this is 34.99. And it's a really, it, genuinely feels really warm it feels like a good puffer sometimes you can buy a puffer coat and it just feels really thin but this feels like it's going to keep me really warm it's got some quite deep-ish pockets not big enough to like I mean, you could probably fit your phone in there but you'd be a bit worried but yeah it's really nice fleece lined not fleece lined i wish it was fleece lined but yeah that's really really nice and just noticed they've got drawstrings down here to tighten it so that you can have it like tight to your waist or you can wear it baggy. I like that. I really, really like this. This is like a lovely, lovely material. These are padded as well. They're actually padded, not fake padding. This is really big, oversized, perfect for dog walking. And because it doesn't have a hood, I can just pop the hood out here. I'm really pleased. Like I said, I went for a medium. Up top, I'm usually like an 8 to 10. So I just wanted it really oversized so that I can fit all the layers underneath. Let's do it up. Now I just look like a big marshmallow. <laughs> Let's pull these up. Still a marshmallow? Definitely a marshmallow. I think I have to wear this undone. <laughs> Oh, I look really comfy cosy. We have some white trainers. I kind of like that. I kind of like that. Got myself a t-shirt. Now this for a t-shirt was quite, maybe, I don't know if it's expensive, but for a basic t-shirt, I think it was 17 99 However, I really liked these kind of ruched, structured shoulders so it's more like can you see i don't know if you'll be able to see because it's black but it's got ruched structured shoulders here so, so just a bit more it's a bit different to your average just black t-shirt 
but it is again like a basic i got this in a size small it does look a bit big but i did want a quite oversized t-shirt nothing worse than wearing a t-shirt and then feeling like your stomach can be seen through it and things like that so i prefer to just size up the t-shirts but the next thing i got was some denim so i actually only own one pair of jeans that's not okay but this is not the kind of year where i've been wearing jeans admittedly however i thought i need some black jeans and like i say i go on a lot of dog walks i go on a lot of walks the last thing i really want to do is buy jeans with holes in the knees because that's historically what i was doing i've got myself a pair of are these mum jeans loose mum jeans Oh God, what size did I go for? 12p? 12 petite? I don't know if these are going to fit. But these are like a nice kind of black acid wash. I really, really like this detail down here, which goes the whole way down the jeans. They've got the pockets in the back. And this is from the Divided range, which I did not realise. But they've got real pockets. We do like a real pocket. And then they are... I just don't know. I don't know if these are going to look good. But I figured if I put a belt with them, tuck the black t-shirt in, for example, maybe roll these up a little bit, put some boots with them, that might work. Okay, so I messed up a little bit because I don't have, like, the boot, the right boots to go with this. So, from, from this angle, kind of nice. I just don't know if they're meant to be baggy around here, if I'm too wide for this they're kind of comfy i'm just i'm not sure on the fit like they do look really nice with this top but i don't know if it just kind of make draws attention to this bit yeah at the bottom i've got my slipper socks on but i don't know if i meant to like maybe like roll them up once and then put some boots with them i think the mistake i've made is i've gone for petite so i need to get some chunky boots try them on with um i don't know i do not know i'm not sure the next thing that i've got is some knitwear i did want more knitwear but everything was going in and out of stock where obviously everyone was shopping but this is a lovely lovely beautiful roll neck jumper i love this so soft big big sleeves chunky oversized i got this in a size small i did go for small. i was tempted by medium but i went small because it does look quite big and i wanted big i want something that i can wear over my leggings under a coat oh it just feels so soft i don't know if it's wool let me have a look Oh, what's really nice as well is at the edges it's got that split there. I really like that. So this is... I just... <laughs> it's all fluffs going right up my nose. But yeah, this is really gorgeous. I'm really looking forward to trying this on. So I'll probably wear it maybe like that rather than like that. But you can wear it either way. But yeah, it's quite nice the trend at the moment where people actually don't roll it down and it's just like... All the way up here to hide all your chin and i did pick up some jewelry again things went in and out of my basket but this oh is it long yeah this is a long necklace so it is tucked in there but i just thought this is really nice i just wanted a chunky necklace so that i can pop it kind of over my jumpers like that i've been wearing quite a bit of gold at the moment this was, I think, $3.99, real bargain. It's actually quite heavy, considering it's $3.99. It feels really nice quality. Okay, so this is the oversized jumper. Admittedly, it is a little bit itchy, but I really, really like it. The sleeves are huge. I've got this in a medium. I've got the slit here. Probably would look quite good, like, tucked in a little bit. I quite like that. Let's tuck that little rogue bit in. That looks quite nice. I'm wearing it with leggings, so it probably look a little bit better with jeans. But yeah, I really like that. I've teamed it with the necklace. 
The roll neck bit, I'm a bit unsure on this, so the trend is not to roll your roll neck down, but I do feel a little bit Edwardian or Elizabethan, I don't know what era, but if you roll it over, which I think my neck's not that long, so I might look better rolled over, what do you think? I think this is a little bit long. Yeah, I think that's probably a little bit better. Tuck that bit in here, a little bit loose. Covers my bum, which I love, especially if you're wearing ever so slightly see-through leggings. Um, yeah, I really, really like this. And I really like the necklace as well. Pleased with this. I did get a top. I got a top. Actually, I got two tops. I got a shirt and a top. And the reason that I purchased these is because I thought I might be going out for dinner with maybe some friends in December. And um, that's not going to be the case now, is it? But it's still nice to have a few nice tops ready for... Maybe Christmas Day. The first top that I got, ooh, this is a bit fancy, is this kind of lovely like mesh polka dot mesh sleeves. This is a bit out of my comfort zone admittedly but I really liked the detail of this and I figured that you could really dress this down with a pair of jeans and like a chunky necklace and a belt rather than it be because Looking like that, it looks quite sexy. Like, I've got a vision. I've got a vision. I'm just hoping it pays off because otherwise this might just feel like underwear. Okay, so I must admit, this sweetheart neckline is so lovely. I don't have a big chest or much of a chest at all, but it kind of makes you feel like you've got like a nice, elegant chest. I don't know. I kind of like this. What do you think? Is it too much? Am I gonna wear it? I don't know, it just makes me feel a little bit dressed up and we haven't got dressed up in so long. <laughs> but I really, really like the detail of it. So this kind of like a fake underwire here, I must admit, what size did I say I got this in? I got this in a size small and chest wise I'm a 32B and this is actually too small for my boob like my bra comes down here so if you are like big chested you'd probably need a medium but i really like this i don't know if i'd wear it though could this be a nice little christmas day outfit i really like the dots here it's just really sweet maybe with some nice necklaces to kind of draw the attention it is really scratchy can you see here i've got like red blotches because it's scratched as i put it on it's the only problem like i've got really sensitive like skin here yeah i mean it's kind of nice i don't know now this feels absolutely beautiful this is like a satin lovely pink oversized shirt which actually will really look quite nice for like maybe just videos if i can't wear it out for dinner so I'd probably wear that unbuttoned, not unbuttoned, but not necessarily up to the top. Pop a necklace over it, tuck it in my jeans, if the jeans fit, and it's really nice. It's kind of pleated at the back. This is really smart, but you can wear it if I've gone up, I've gone up a size. Yeah, I've gone for a size medium. So I'm hoping that it's quite oversized so that I can just wear it casually rather than feel like it's smart wear. But that's really beautiful, like the silk silk is it polyester no it's not silk at all but yeah it just it just looks it looks a lot more expensive than it was i think this is maybe about 25 maybe if that so you can either wear it tucked in here and like a little bit with the shoulder out there do it up a bit more like this and like really really cinch it in here that's quite cute why do I think that's quite cute? Wait. I don't like always following trends. Totally looks like a different top, right? That's quite sweet. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I do feel a little bit like I'm in my pyjamas. Like I feel really cosy. This is such a nice material. Probably because it feels really similar to a pyjama material. And you could always, you know, I've kept the sleeves like that. 
could always just kind of really like mess it up so it just feels really kind of trendy so you can wear this really smart really cute or really fashiony it's kind of a multifunctional top i'm quite impressed with this although i must admit I need a steamer and i don't own a steamer and the last thing i got was a little bit of homeware because i love a little bit of homeware I have been wanting to get my hands on this for a while now. This isn't going to be to everyone's taste. Hell, I don't even think it's going to be to Sean's taste. He's going to be like, what is that? I'm obsessed. Meet Martha. Yes, yes, Martha. Look at her. I mean, it could be a him. We don't know. But I'm calling her Martha and I'm really obsessed. <laughs> I just think this is so nice. <laughs> Sean, I really want to film Sean's reaction. Honestly, he's going to be like, Whoa. <laughs> But anyway, I really like this. This is so to my taste. It's like a real, like, it's real sturdy ceramic on a, oh, I don't know if that's actually real ceramic, but it is cold. So it might be on a wooden base and I am gonna pop it, I don't know where, but right now, Martha can live there. <laughs> so, <laughs> I, maybe I'll do a cutaway of where I put it, I don't know. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Hit like if you did like it and hit subscribe so you can see more of these. I'm hoping to do more fashion hauls in the new year, um, especially loungewear because I don't know, I've definitely not got enough loungewear and that is life these days. Loungewear, dog walks, pyjamas. Loungewear, dog walks, pyjamas, the odd garden centre trip, but that's probably going to be in loungewear. So <laughs> I hope you've enjoyed this. Thank you so much for stopping by and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.